Woo! What's up, YouTube? Look at these beautiful fall colors here. Oh, uh, we got a few landscaping jobs going on today, and then tomorrow we got a trash out a house. I'm going to send a few guys down there to clean out, so that should be pretty exciting. Today we just got, uh, we should go check on Holly, Chris, and Sean, and then I got Hunter and Tech. They're down in Boscobel. Today we're going to work on not saying the word S-O. Apparently there's minutes of it that Derek has to edit out in every video. I'm going to work on that today. <laughs> not, not saying it. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, we got a clean out to do tomorrow. That should be pretty exciting. I went and looked at it. It's not that bad. It looks like somebody passed away or, I don't know. It's like everything's still there. Medicine bottle still there. Mail still on the table. Like they just up and left or passed away or something. I don't know. So. Is it a hoarder type? No, it's not a hoarder. It's like oh. somebody just normal living left. We already made it to the job. Four blocks away. Not bad. Yeah, let's go see how these guys are doing. This is a two-day job. They were here all day yesterday. And basically pulling out all the mulch. They're leaving the edgers. And then... They don't want to put plants in because it's fall. They want to put those in in the spring. And then they're going to replace where the mulch was with rock. Holly's over here digging like a mule. She's even uh, wearing gloves. She's wearing gloves today. And she's got her one of one Pagel Services sweatshirt that nobody else is allowed to have. Nobody yep. else has one. You are one of a kind, Holly. I hope you know that. <laughs> this was all full of mulch, plants. This was a mess yesterday. They got everything out of here. It's looking pretty good. I'm pretty sure I put this edging in like six or seven years ago. Doesn't look too bad. And then we're just putting the pots in. Like I said, they don't want to put the plants in because it's middle of October. We'll do that in the spring, but at least the pots are there. So in the spring, we can pull the pots out, put the plants in. Done. This was all like overgrown. This bed here was pretty rough shape. But they got it all cleaned out, looks good. They trimmed those trees up. There's a bunch of roots in here. It's not too bad, but it was it was kind of a mess. And the, it's an older couple that lives here. So they want something that uh, is easy to maintain. And rock beds is definitely the way to go. You don't have to, they don't have to mess with mulch every year trying to clean it up. Hey, Sean. Hey. You need help with anything? No. See what I'm using to get this off with? Because we don't have a service truck here. Is it working? No. Kind of like a monkey fucking a baseball back here. What was that quote you just said? A monkey fucking a baseball? You ever seen that before? No. <laughs> but I imagine then this is what, know, I know imagine what this like. is what it would be like. <laughs> Reminder to self, if I ever see your farm laying around, check the search history. <laughs> yes, check search and don't do that. <laughs> I thought maybe you were talking about Chris's new boyfriend. That was a day and a half. Chris's new male, male masseuse guy was all over him. Did you hear what, what he told Holly? The guy gave me a business card, massages by Harry or whatever. He's a masseuse. His name's even Harry? Yes. Okay. And he scratched off the actual like number and he put his personal number on the backside. And he went up to Holly, oh, I gave Chris a business card to get, get a back rub. I doubt he'll do it though. She's like, oh, I could use a back rub. My back's hurting. He looks right at him. I only do guys. Yeah. You only do those guys. <laughs> you guys just got that and this to clean out? Yeah, these two end right in front of the mailbox. Oh, okay. Then we're gonna start that with Holly. Sure. We should bring a trimmer up and yeah. Trim yep. all that edging. Yeah, we got the trimmer. We were going to okay. do that too. That would make it look a lot better. Yep. You doing the next apple juice live with me, Holly? Hell yeah. The only problem is, is your apple juice is going to be a little harder than my apple juice, it sounds like. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> what if we do a, a golf outing? Are you going to come golf with us? I mean, I guess I'm going to have to. <laughs> sounds lame. Golf. The only reason I'd go is to watch you swing a golf club. <laughs> Because I bet you could absolutely That's, launch one. Oh, yeah. Maybe twice. <laughs> be zero control. <laughs> Just 
whack it. <laughs> John Daly. Just give it a good whack it. Huh. These guys will probably be here till probably the end of the day. The other project we're doing here is we're gonna rip out this chunk of concrete. This is bad. And then they want this all concrete as well. So dig all this out, put a nice four inch gravel base in there, compact or really good, and pour this whole thing. He doesn't have to mow this little strip of grass. Doesn't make any sense. That's another day though. Probably next week we'll do this concrete. Because it looks like looks like all this other concrete's new and then for some reason this piece is old. We should probably fix this too. Yeah, we'll probably cut probably fix that for him too. Alright, these guys got her figured out. Don't really need to tell them much. Bobcat sounds a little squeaky. Squeak! Hunter and Tech. Those guys went and did a little wall last night, Derek. Well, I say last night because they got done at like 8 o'clock. A one day wall. Put a picture of it right here, Derek. Boom. Boom. So, yeah, they just had to rip that wall out and replace it with new block. Pretty easy. Didn't have their correct backfill or the correct base, so they fixed all that. But they got it done in one day, so that's pretty exciting. What do you know? I'm gonna have to offer you a hand job or something for that dual lance wand I want. I'll tomorrow morning. I just want that, two so. new nozzles for our pressure washer. Two wands, yeah. Yeah, short ones. Don't be bringing me no long ones. Oh, I know. Which it's only been a couple months. It's not I bad. know. When I have a chance, I keep forgetting. And then it'll take you a couple months to send me a bill, so. Maybe. Depends how much the wife yells at you. She'll yell at me no matter what. Yeah. I'll not. make a fucking note and put it right in the truck right now. Oh, fuck. You probably got a whole box of notes you don't look at. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. That's my pressure washer guy. It's the guy that sold us our pressure washer, and uh, whenever I need something, he gets it for me. But his memory is a little, a little vague. Wands, yeah. I get all bent up and beat up and every couple of years we just put a couple new ones on. What do you want? Um, please pick up your order uh, from May. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we that? probably should. Okay, I'll look it on your desk. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we got some packages. What'd you order? I ain't no way. It's here already. It says chemical warehouse. It'd be drugs for Dan. Yeah, we're not making any money spraying lawn, so we're going to start cooking math. Yeah, I guess where the money's at. <laughs> yep, we got her. Sweet. Cheapo Depot. What's in this one? That one I don't think is. Show Derek your picture. <laughs> so I'm coming into town here. This guy's pulling this Ranger backwards. He doesn't have the steering wheel locked. And when it's going down the road, it's just all over. I'm like, that's nice and safe. You should get that up to highway speed. <laughs> nice new pens. Yeah. 400 new pens. Today only, if you buy on paperservices.net yeah, slash shop. Yeah, these will be on the shop. $9.99 per pen. Now, these are the best pens money can buy right here. We got a box of pens, some chemicals. We got Dan here. And hey, we're going to see if they work. I can almost guess what you're going to write on that. Do they work? They work good. Yeah. You put it on all your receipts for your spray lawns? Oh, yeah. Everybody. All the yeah. customers. They look on that. the back like, Derek sucks. Huh. You know, I should almost <laughs> get a stamp for them. But. <laughs> I got a lot of people asking for three, four, and five X shirts. I don't know how much of that we're going to stock. I wear a 2X. Dan wears 3X. Sean wears 3X. I Colors. guess we got a large audience, huh? <laughs> we got a big audience. <laughs> Our audience is huge. Yeah, so I don't know. What, are we going to throw some of these in free with the orders, Derek, or what? Oh, yeah. Probably. Ain't nothing like having a pen explode all over your brand new stuff. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> and then we'll put in a little bit of this in there with it, too. Uh, not sure we need to anthrax anybody, but... Yeah. <laughs> Derek. 
What are you doing with a shovel in your hand? Well, you know, you got the big operator over there. We even brought the old Johnny Deer up and put her to work. It's risky. I already took the stickers off. I thought you were selling it. I am. Oh, all right. I didn't want to move the Bobcat up here, so. Well, if anyone asks if it works, we can show them this video. Oh, it does work. It just, I don't know, it doesn't like me, the concrete guy. Got the walls poured, pad poured. They're putting some big tanks on here. Not sure what it is, but we have to fix all these rock beds back up and then fix the grass. Today, we're just gonna clean up all this junk and debris. And next week, they'll probably come set the tanks. And then we can clean the yard up, fix her all up. Good to go. Is Hunter your best operator? Hunter's my operator. We should do some sort of competition, him versus you, or you gotta move material or something. I'd fucking kill him. <laughs> uh, he's come a long way, he's doing good. But there's always room for improvement, even myself. And a lot of times now, with all my experience, I really think about not making more damage. So like Ray went before you got here, he was over there taking giant, giant scoops. And I went over and I'm like, please don't do that, because then you're gonna drill, dribble some and leak some and make a mess. It's more to clean up. And that's not supposed to be level with the walls. Kind of weird how they did that, but it looks nice. Hey, Tech, you got a moment? Yeah. How you doing? Good. Yeah. How's Hunter doing in there? Probably happy he finally gets to drive that. After he spent a full week fixing it. His birthday present. Okay, let's give him that to him for his birthday? No, his present was he got to fix it. Oh, I got it. What was the last thing you fixed around here? Well, I'm gonna have to fix the dump trailer now because Hunter broke it last night. Oh, good. Yeah. Hunter broke the dump trailer last night? Yeah, running equipment. <laughs> All right. See, like right now, he should have came over by us and he should be pushing it that way. Not that, that little pile there. Pushing it out into the grass. Just making more of a mess. I'd come over here and I'd shove it back over there because there's already shit over here. Talking about him, so he's gonna go over to the other pile. So we just keep going wherever he goes and just talking yeah. about him? Yeah, we can try it. Why don't you have the big boy dump truck here? Uh, Bob's in cross planes right now, getting some rock. Oh. Yeah, so see. See, we're just gonna pretend like we're pointing at him and talking about him, but yeah. we're not really. So he's probably in a skid loader, like, what the fuck are they saying right now? But when you can't, you know, we'll just pretend like it's a big issue. Oh, you, you just point to it. Yeah. See, then he gets all worked up, like with the clean stone the other day when you were talking about him. Like, and then we just gotta throw our arms in the air, and then we'll go like this, pretend like we're talking bad about him. And he's gonna think, what the fuck are you guys talking about? See over here, this is a pile too. Yeah. You just point to it there. Yeah, right here? That's another pile. Yeah, that's another pile. So we'll just keep pointing and acting like he's doing something wrong. I don't know. And here too? It's way too, it's too low. Yeah. It's too deep. <laughs> we, don't, we don't know, he's in the skid loader just like, what the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> There's a good way to get us to stop talking about it. Yeah, just run, run us over. I got an idea. I'll hold up one of these big ass sticks and you gotta kick it, break it. You think you could do that? I'm not Kevin Van Dam or whoever you're talking about. Jean Claude Van Dam. Blood sport tech. Look it up, watch it, learn a few things. You could kick the absolute piss out of one of those, Tech. That's teamwork, D Rock. Yeah. <laughs> now, if you really want to impress me, you'll break one of them, some bitches. <laughs> Hunter, are you driving that track, Skitty? Oh, yeah. Now, who got this up and running? I don't know. I think it was you. Uh, might have been. Might have been. Caleb told me he's going to sell it. 
I think he just needs to give it to you for your birthday. I, or Christmas present. I mean, Christmas present. That'd be fine. Yeah, I'd be okay with. That. You don't need that hundred dollar bonus. You'll take a track skit. Yeah. 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 Maybe he'd get everybody one. I don't think Tech needs one. These guys were supposed to give me duck meat from duck season, but you guys haven't brought me anything yet. We, it, you had said something to us Monday. Good for your dexterity. On a scale of zero to ten, how bad you screw up the dump trailer, Hunter? Eight. Do you say hey or eight? Eh, it's probably like a four. Four? Oh, that's not bad. Four out of five? Out of ten. Oh. It wouldn't yeah. even move. Wouldn't even move? No. What? It does though. You couldn't dump it. Now you can. I that I fixed that. Is that that same one we were just sitting there waiting on you? UTV trail? Yeah. 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 Yeah, that I had all the freaking dirt already spread out by the time he got from Stitzer to Fenimore. You were dumping dirt in a big hole. That's probably why we pay Tech $13 an hour and you $28 an hour, Hunter. Yeah. Tech's got a movement going on the old YouTube. They want him to get a raise. Sorry, not Tech. Mud flaps. Yeah, that's <laughs> <laughs> I suppose after this we should go see how some other guys are doing. Hopefully they got that rock done. I think Bob just got back from getting a load of decorative rocks. We make him replace the airbag? Yeah, no. Most of these guys will have tomorrow off because they already got 40 or 45 hours. John, Eric, Dan, and Holly, I think they're a little short on hours, so they'll go do that uh, trash out and be good to go. Yeah, all right. What did you learn out of work a shovel? Never ran one before. Not for today. Up there? Yeah. Tech, I found one of the ducks you shot. Probably a big one, huh? Oh yeah. That's a goose. <laughs> Tech, you gonna get drunk tonight? No. Why not? Yeah, I might go duck on this morning. I'm gonna get drunk tonight. You're gonna get drunk? Love drunk. Drunk on Carmelo. I don't think that's a thing. Everything's so dry still. Yeah. Who's your duck hunting partner, Tech? Well, he's an alcoholic. You can't even tell anymore? That's what happens when you drink vodka when you wake up. How many orders went out of the merch shop today? 23. 23? It's not bad. Trying to up our game a little bit here, folks. Go to pagoservices.net slash shop. Grab yourself some shirts, sweatshirts, hats, mugs. We got a new ad. Coasters. We got the can coo apple can, juice, apple juice koozies. Can koozies. New item, hot and fresh. Hot and fresh. And every order, every order we're throwing in a sticker or some pens and stuff, you know, we're just spoiling you guys. So head on over there, support the merch shop. We appreciate it. And guess what? If our merch shop stays busy, you ain't ever gonna see no ads in our fucking videos. I don't wanna do those. So just support our merch shop so we don't have to put any of those crappy ads in there for you guys and talk to you for two minutes about drinking something before you start your day. This is Caleb. You went 0 for 2 on those last two shovel throws. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> I don't want to run that machine. I'm afraid it'll break every time I run it, something goes wrong. We doing all the plastic edging and stuff for this too? Probably, yeah, we'll have, we'll have to clean everything up here. It's a mess. That's all right. What's your favorite item we've got in the merch shop? Yeah, I haven't even looked at it. What? See what the fuck? <laughs> this is bullshit. Remember when I said I'm gonna get all 
the employees that cut of the YouTube profits? Yeah, I, I tell these guys that I'm gonna give them some of the YouTube profits here, and then if we ever make any, they don't. Uh, they don't support the merch. They don't even look at the merch. They don't even watch the fucking ch the videos. I think Tech and Hunter do, but like John, he don't watch them. Sean, he don't watch them. And then we walk up to Sean with the camera, and he doesn't even say anything. How are we? How are we gonna give them a percentage of the pay? What the hell? That's if we ever start making money. <laughs> Do you have a favorite movie? Not really, no. I don't really watch movies. Hagel Services, we watch a lot of that. <laughs> a movie is generally two hours. Yeah, we're gonna... We do that a week. We'll get there. We make a movie a week. But seriously, Tech, what's your favorite item? The, uh, double Stroker, that one? Yeah. That's a pretty solid choice. Yeah? Yeah. How do you like yours? Pretty good, I'm still getting it broken. Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to find someone for that second side of it. Because you know what it is, right? There's a guy on one side with it, and then there's a guy on the other side. Yeah. So you're just using it single right now. Yeah. Well, I think your hunting partner would probably help you out. I don't know. Now you can put it on a doorknob, though. Yeah? Yeah. Kind of holds it. Sure. Yeah. But I can tell you, by Christmas time, I'm probably going to have holes in all my drywall at waist height. <laughs> concrete because when we, when we bring in clean stone we'll probably dump it where that clean stone's been dumped yeah. but get the concrete or any junk out of that pile throw it in here okay then we'll probably call it good for the day mm -hmm. yeah right call this is a job for today there's not much else we can do i want to wait till they get those tanks on there our luck will have to fucking change something Where else do you think he's going? Hey, excuse me, sir. What's the plan now? Boss. Yeah, I don't know. He just said... <laughs> dead. Yeah. You wanna hear something, though? Yeah. You don't hear a big-ass fan run in D-Rock. So much nicer than that other one. Ah! Not a big fan of the Bobcat cooling down? No. Right. Hear this? Look at this. Because this fucking thing doesn't need to cool down. It's that fucking. Well, did you take it out when you fixed it all up, or what? They just never had one. No, it's just they don't need. They it. don't need it. They don't. They're not like them fucking. Either. You'd prefer this over the Bobcat? I mean, no. I mean, <laughs> so it depends. Like, I like this. Okay. But uh, I just don't want it to break. I don't like when it breaks because then I gotta fix it. Yeah. This and one does a good job of breaking. Yes, it's a lot better because it buffs smoke. Yeah, a lot of smoke. And this bad. Does it have more power? Yeah. Oh, yeah. But the other one's smoother? Oh, yeah. Handles better? Yeah. Because it's newer. It's not worn like this. Sure. This thing's been broke in. You know, it's like when you get a new... When you get a new... Girlfriend? Glove. No. You gotta knock the old sidewalls out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Break but... her in. <laughs> gotta break her in, Ted. But no, I'm putting it in your perspective for you, D-Rock. Oh, gotcha. You got... It's like when you get a new baseball glove. Okay. You know... They're a lot nice, like the old nice ones that are malleable. Are, yep, are a lot better. Yeah, like this one. Like this old girl. Yeah, but you never know. A ball might just shoot right through your glove. But mm. if you have a new one, you know it's stiff. Mm -hmm. But a ball won't go through. You know, your ball won't go through the glove. This one got hit by a plow truck. Yeah, this one did. That's really good. That's a really good description. I understood that. Yeah, I yeah. I think it would have been better if you used ex-girlfriends as the example. Oh, that's what Tech did. Yeah. But Tech Tech's never had, Tech's never had an ex-girlfriend. Is the thing he's only had one girlfriend. And he's always just he oh, he's always horny. Always twenty-four-seven. <laughs> Anytime I ask you how you're doing, eighty-five percent horny. Yeah. <laughs> like it, I'm sometimes scared, D Rock. How old are you, Hunter? I just turned twenty-five. Just turned 25. Okay, so your horniness is probably there, but it's probably on the decline. Yeah. Tex is at an all-time high. <laughs> nah, I don't think so. He literally just got done telling me he bangs his drywall in his house. He puts <laughs> holes in it. Oh my God. He yeah, thought I thought was... that was a little rough and myself. He was asking about my double stroke. <laughs> yeah. And he says he doesn't even use it. 
He just he's just gonna have to drywall. fix all the drywall. He's got oh, that well. thing so calloused up, he can't even barely feel on it anymore. <laughs> Parker's damn near glued shut. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I, yeah, he said I can load this back up, but or we gotta go back and fix the dump trailer. <laughs> you still haven't fixed that yet? I thought you said you fixed it. No, I fixed it so it moves, but I. And then, I, uh, then I put a ratchet strap across the back so the doors wouldn't open and the skid loader buck would fall out. Okay. And it's still like that. We wonder why things get broken. Figured I'd run over here and see how these guys are doing. Said they were going to finish these rock beds up today. Want to make sure they're gonna get them done. I actually sent tech up here to help them finish, but it's the end of the week for them. It's Thursday, like I said, they already got their hours in. Bob got that bin full. Is that all you guys got left? Is that bad? Yeah. Oh, you'll have plenty then. Should be good. Oh, yeah. Okay. How much bugs is still here? Well, looks like they got the rock in all up here. Looking fly. This is all mulch before overgrown. Plants, crap. Look at that operator. You're an operator. I like one. Yeah. Looks like he's been watching Hunter. Yeah, this is going to be a lot easier for them to maintain and uh, take care of. They'll be super stoked. We got her all whipped. Just got to finish this one or what? Yeah, got to push the rock around. Okay. Edgers on the back side of that fence just so it held it in better. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, some of these edgers are a little, a little wonky but that really wasn't in the estimate to fix them i mean they're in pretty good shape maybe sometime i could send somebody up here to touch them up a little bit but they're doing their job they're holding the rocks in just hanging around if i wasn't here he'd be going 100 mile an hour right now i'll see you guys will probably be done another hour Looks like a smooth operation to me. I don't need to babysit these guys. I'm gonna let them finish this up. Probably another hour and they'll be out of here and call it a week. The next day. What a beautiful Friday it is here. Oh, we poured that concrete yesterday and man, was I sore yesterday after that ordeal. Okay, I gotta stop talking to Hunter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pour more concrete today. Yeah, I'm just gonna run over there and cut that strip the form, so. Okay. Sounds good. See ya. Yep. Hunter's got the day off. Yesterday, I was really sore after that. I love working. I love doing physical labor. But the honest truth is, I just don't do it a lot anymore. So when it comes time to do it, man, whoo old body is just a hurting actually today I feel great but yesterday I was a little bit sore and we had a little bit of a leg cramp late last night had one of our uh, super fans stop into the office her name is Michelle um, her and her husband watch our channel pretty religiously they traded some cookies for some shirts and a hat and let me tell you what these cookies are absolutely amazing and this is the reason I'm fat because this is what my mom does all the time she brings cookies snacks all this shit everywhere I go it's right in front of me and it's really hard to say no and these things are amazing so thank you Michelle we appreciate you um, hope you guys enjoy your shirts and hats I'm gonna meet Chris over there in Potosi and uh, we're just gonna strip those forms off and cut that concrete quick probably call it a day uh, I got a bunch of stuff to do in the office work with Derek and a bunch of other stuff going on that I need to get done and uh, Chris has already got 40 or 45 hours uh, especially this time of year we don't need to be working crazy overtime so so let's head over there 
Yeah, that's not good. I mean, it's just damp. We got three inches of rain, so. But, but yeah, that's from him not rubbing that out big like I told him to. It'll probably be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. No, another claw hammer. Everything here looks good. Minus that. That's where Hunter was on that knee pad yesterday, rubbing that out. And it looks like he left a little minuscule low spot. Not much we can do about that now. If she complains about it, then we'll have to cut that section out and redo it. But it'll probably be fine, honestly. I don't want to walk in the mud because then... I'm going to be doing the cutting. Yeah, you yeah, really shouldn't be using screws. Hunter likes to use screws in there and that makes it a pain in the ass to pull everything apart. up on that corner of the board you get all these nails out I can't oh, be... yeah, I hear it. It should be good. I'd say spend uh, 20 minutes brooming and blowing this all off. And like when you get out to these edges, yep. this stuff just breaks off. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. I don't know why we had such a problem brooming it yesterday. I don't understand. Once it gets cleaned off and dries, it you won't even tell, but. If you want to hand me that broom, I'll start brooming a little yeah. bit, I guess. I don't want to walk in the mud. Let's see if that frog's alive. You think? Yeah. Oops. <laughs> bottom of this broom works pretty good for getting all this shit off. Alright, I gotta get going. Alrighty. I'd Sounds say good. just do that, use the bottom of the broom and then sweep it and then blow it off. Somebody, did you guys clean the siding yesterday? Or? Cause there was marks on. Unless, she, unless she came out this morning and did it, I don't know. This would be hot today, huh? Yeah, it's supposed to be warm when they yeah, other than that spot, it looks good to me. All right, I'm out of here. Alrighty, Thanks. You. Yep, you too. Got that all cut. Chris doesn't have a lot of experience cutting new concrete, so I figured I better do it. I guess I probably could have showed him how, but he's pulling the forms off so whatever it's kind of disappointing that's the first time uh, anytime I've ever poured concrete that we had a little 
just a little bit of a dip in there so it's not much it's kind of hard to see on camera I mean obviously it's easy to see because it's moisture in the concrete right now it just rained last night I don't think it's gonna be that bad if it's something that's uh, gonna bother her or be an issue then we will uh, we'll have to cut out that section and replace that section of concrete so whatever i should have told hunter yesterday like i said yesterday we were kind of struggling um i should have told him when he was out on those knee boards that you gotta fill you gotta make sure that's filled back in when you're uh, coming back off your knee boards otherwise the rest of that looks good once it all cures out turns bright white you really won't see any of that other stuff and i don't know who did her other concrete but uh there's definitely some issues with that uh, not talking shit because our stuff ain't perfect either but whoever did that concrete for her driveway and stuff there's definitely some waves and stuff in that gotta get back to the office work with Derek and Justin for a while and then uh, Chris is probably just gonna work another hour and uh, he doesn't live too far from here so just zoom home well, pretty easy day today I think Dan's spraying uh, the spraying's been pretty tough the last three weeks because we haven't had any rain in like a month, month and a half. So told Dan he better get his ass in gear and get spraying because it's been tough this dry. So Monday they'll come back there and uh, finish up all the dirt work. She wants some caps on that little planter bed thing on that little wall those guys made. So I don't really understand, but because the top of those blocks are flat, but she wants a cap, so whatever. We'll put caps on there, and then basically they got to do a bunch of seed and straw and some dirt work there, and then they are done and out of there. Uh, the calls really picked up the last couple days. Um, I know last week Justin said there really wasn't much for estimates coming in. And then all of a sudden this week they just start coming back in. So I'm not really sure how to, you know, there's really no way of telling when and when they're not going to come in. But uh, it's almost like a light switch. Now they're coming back in hot. So that's good. He's busy. I know he's lining up more jobs. Um, I know he just bid four, two concrete jobs in Fenimore. Rock bed jobs in Fenmore, so be nice to get those nice and close, right in town. We ain't got to travel far, and it's getting towards the end of the season here. Things are gonna slow down eventually. Maybe they won't. Who knows? I don't know. I just hope we get some snow this winter. That's all I care about. So I'll tell you what, it's fucking hot for the end of September. 85 degrees. Holy shit! Better get back to the air conditioned office where there's cookies. Also, I don't know what in the hell was going on yesterday, but that broom that I was trying to use, I I don't know what was going on, but that broom was being a pile of shit. Um, I don't know if it was because it was brand new or the concrete or what, but I, I could not get it to look nice. And then the old broom, you know, the one that's been used for a couple years and is kind of wore out, that one, if you'd broom it with that, it would look really nice. Um, but I couldn't, somebody had the threads all wore out, so I couldn't get the the pole screwed into it. That was kind of a struggle, but you know, this is real life, and that's what happens when you don't pour concrete every day. So, you know, if we poured concrete every day, I'd be a little more on my game, and uh, probably have a better broom, and definitely have a bigger edger. I don't know why we only have that little two inch edger we have a four inch one somewhere and it works so much better for edging um all that matters is she's happy and uh the job's job's done what's up bitch what the fuck are you doing it's supposed to be a surprise and he found me good morning hunter <laughs> I gotta go to the bathroom. You gotta go to the bathroom? Yeah. Alright, well, yeah. since no, you it's your day, I gotta come with. <laughs> Hello, Mama Gunlock. Hi, good morning. What you got here? 
Well, I got pizzas for Hunter's birthday, but his birthday's tomorrow. I know you have meetings today, so. <laughs> that was nice of you. Yeah. You didn't hide well enough? I did. I was way over there. All of a sudden he comes around. I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm like, well, I'm supposed to surprise you. <laughs> Morning, Eric. Morning. You know what goes perfect with a mocha coffee monster? Pizza. Casey's breakfast pizza. <laughs> We're trying to, we're hoping to catch the surprise on camera. I know. Darn Hunter. You were just in here, wasn't he? He's taking a poop. Or That's pee. That's why he yelled at me. Or pee. He I'm must not, sure. not have got up early enough at all. Two of them are breakfast pizzas. How do you think we're going to eat all this? Well, you're all guys. I didn't know. So I should take that. Good on. morning. Lunch Good morning. and supper. Well, Tech's going to have a half a pizza for sure. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Happy New Year. For Hunter. Right away. For me? 5.30 this morning. I walk. Head first into the corner of the wall. <laughs> Full walking <laughs> speed. <laughs> My neck. But you guys don't have any of that. really bad. I fell to the floor. Like. Yeah, you probably got a concussion. It hurt. Morning, Sean. Morning. How many alarms do you have? Five. Hmm. That's not enough. No. <laughs> Every five minutes? I got our new next video. Okay. The boss takes us all to Wisconsin Dallas to a massage. For a massage? Oh, oh my God. Okay. That sounds so good right now. <laughs> I'd ask you certain questions, but your mother's present. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I heard it all. <laughs> so that would be why when I passed you last night, you had a big shit-eating grin on your face. <laughs> Just driving... Thought about smoking you out, but the fiance in the passenger seat said no. Just coming back, so I was kind of tired. <laughs> didn't know if Four you'd real, <laughs> didn't know if you'd recognize us because I put different tires on it. Hunter comes around the corner. I was like, yeah, I was like, oh. you found her. <laughs> you can't. Instantly. You go out there and look at her car. You tell me you wouldn't fucking see that car from six. Why? It's just white. It should it's blend white. with all you guys. <laughs> it's got. Stickers on the mirrors, front mirrors, huh? so you know that's her. It's got glittery seats, you know that's her. <laughs> Sounds a lot like my car so far. <laughs> Steering wheel, glitter. Yeah. Good morning, morning, morning John. John. Hey, Johnny boy. All right. <laughs> Where's Chris? Where's Chris? It's not 701 yet. He's got five minutes. Are you a graphic designer? I got the design I want for a t-shirt that we should sell. That we should sell? Okay, I guarantee it to sell. All right. Tech, you know about this? No, I don't. <laughs> this is the last night thing I thought of. Okay. So, Hit me. I can't let nobody else know. Because they fine. might steal the idea. We get a mini loader on the back. And we have it. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. Okay. And we put like... That was a heck of an idea. Of course I could design that. Great idea. So what are we doing? John brought pizza? This is for Hunter's birthday tomorrow, but I knew you had meetings on Monday, so I just did it today. How old is Hunter tomorrow? 16. <laughs> <laughs> 21. 25. Wow, look at you. Next time you need to go to Enterprise, you can use him now. <clears throat> yep. But after 21, you can do whatever the hell you want. <laughs> mm. How's that been working for you? Great. Yeah. <laughs> He's never running a car, though. So. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's pretty lively here on Monday morning. I see so. that. And I'm like, well, this is different than my work. <laughs> it's about like a funeral. <laughs> I know. <laughs> So two of them are breakfast pizzas, and then two, one of them is sausage, and one of them is pepperoni. Jesus, nobody's going to want to do anything today. <laughs> <laughs> then they won't have to stop for lunch. How about that? Yeah, right. <laughs> huh. Well, you guys enjoy. Here's okay. some more. I didn't know how many plates, so. Well, thank you very thank much. You. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. See ya. I ain't got much here anyway, so um, Justin, them guys were saying, I think Hunter was saying, Pictures on work orders. Yeah, yeah. we talked about okay. getting Friday, Friday back. back. And... Yeah. <laughs> What's he been? It's six fifty nine. <laughs> um, just a reminder: keep sending Derek pictures for stories, and then next week we're probably gonna switch that over to Sydney, 
and have her start taking care of that. So and mowing crew, you guys just mow everything this week. Don't skip anything unless somebody tells you that specifically. And then uh, if you have extra time, I'll have a list of stuff you guys can get done. Um, Dan, where are you spraying this week? Right, Platteville, I think. I think it's going to be about a mix of everywhere. Okay. Yeah, I really want to hammer down on the spraying this week, hopefully. Um, and then that lady wants caps, and she must, okay. Because when I was there, she said forget it. Yeah, when I talked to her after you left. She changed her mind, okay. I really need to get you in the shop Hunter, and get that track machine done, so I'm thinking today would be the best day to yeah. just do it. So Holly and Sean, I got a trimming job in Lancaster. I was thinking of just sending Chris and Tech over to do those caps. Them guys can probably handle that. And then I got another job you guys could go do after that because it's going to be way too wet there. That's all I got. What are you doing today, Derek? Somebody special day. Yeah. I'd like to take this time to wish that someone a very special day. Chris, Wait. thanks for being here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> singing happy birthday it's a little early for that yeah. that should be it so i guess let's all have some pizza and chill out and then go make some money i guess so what kind is that that's the bacon right there that's the one no so we went to a couple of massages this weekend so you and chris went to a couple of massages Isn't that dark? no but we should go to the dallas i don't want to get a massage with you i would absolutely get a massage with you i'm gonna say how long was it Massage. Yeah? What was your favorite part she rubbed on your body? I had one that tight. It's really tight in this groin area because I'm doing. Yeah. Did she get those in her thighs for you? I told her don't touch my feet or else I'll kick you in the face. <laughs> okay. She didn't touch my feet. That's a weird thing to say. <laughs> You're not a feet guy, I get it. Don't like your feet being touched. <laughs> was it really cheap or really expensive? It was really fucking expensive. Oh, yeah. Fucking nuts. What was that? Like 30 bucks a massage. What, 500 for each of you? No. Oh, that sorry. definitely came with a happy ending. <laughs> 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 if it didn't, I'd be pissed. Yeah, I would have went in for a refund for sure. She went back to hide this little old lady. I didn't realize she had that. Yeah. Oh, what did you guys do in a jacuzzi in your room? Do you have a heart shaped bed? Is this a little honey? Did you get married without telling me? Yeah. That's rude, dude. No. You didn't even invite me. I like weddings, they're fun. Do you have rose petals on your bed? No. Little chocolates on the pillows. I think we start doing your B&B. Right here. This room? Right here. You gonna start doing yeah, massages down here? Lay down next to the mowers and. <laughs> It was really nice meeting your mom. Yeah. That was my mom. Okay. What's her name? Lisa. 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 Yeah. That's what I call her. Yeah. She's our number one fan. Is she? Mm -hmm. She watches all of our videos? Oh, yeah. Nice. And, like, every video she always about. defends Hunter when everyone calls him a big pile of shit on the comments. <laughs> well, she, she, she has to. That's her little baby. <laughs> she actually defends me, too, when they call yeah. me a piece of shit. <laughs> She's, uh, Did you say you're sure she's not the one commenting that about it? <laughs> <laughs> It'd be a wild move if she had some burner accounts just to troll Hunter. <laughs> she's getting all of her crunch <laughs> <really knows. laughs> But Derek, is she the first one to like everything on Facebook? Mm -hmm. Her and she's Phil Marshall. Yeah, her and Phil Marshall. And time for a nap. It's <laughs> <laughs> a pretty lively crew. <laughs> Monday morning. I think I know what a good video would be is if we bought one of them Wisconsin Dells ducks. A duck? Wisconsin yeah. Dells like ducks. Okay. Yeah, let's buy a duck. Duck boat. Like for us to take on the Mississippi or do we yeah. gotta go up there and rent? No, I think we should just you buy, can buy, buy one. You buy one, okay. And uh, new oh, one. Exactly. We could do... Is there? Some yeah. They're pretty <laughs> bad at some what? You just you could do some. You could just fucking, you go really fine and fucking water. Yeah, they're not made for rivers and shit. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. It goes in the not, Wisconsin River. Yeah, but it's pretty calm up there. They got it, dam they got it dammed up. It's not care. the same as down here. I don't care. Or could get washed away down here. They go like half the speed of smell. I don't care. Half the speed of smell. <laughs> <laughs> and the they, do stink. Do you know they do stink. How do you they do stink? That's what they probably do. Hunter, you want to send me your Venmo? I'll put it on the video, see if people send you money. I don't have a Venmo. 
Okay. Well, he's going to sign up for a Venmo and we'll add it in afterwards. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. You can add my Venmo. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you'll give it to Hunter, right? Yeah, I'll buy him a drink. Or something. We jumped at how long. Just take the whole thing. We do got a little concrete job signed up. And I do remember it took just now, Freddy. He said he can just for sure to help. And we got the driveway in Montford. Oh, yeah, we got a big driveway, and then we got uh, like a yard to pour right outside of town. Who's doing dishes, Derek or Holly? Derek. Derek. I'm glad they do this dishes. Who's yeah, where are we putting all these? That's good. Happy birthday. Thank you, D-Rock. We're going to go get that skimmer together. Be together this week. Be done this week. <laughs> Been saying that for six months. Well, Derek, at least the viewers now know why we don't film before 8 a.m. Usually, <laughs> because nobody really likes talking in the morning, especially myself. I haven't had one of these yet, so... Uh, that's why we don't film in the morning. Everybody's, it's like a zombie apocalypse. Every Monday morning meeting, so that's just the way it is. I'm still but blurring let's, that out. Let's get to work. What? Am I still blurring that out? Yeah, they haven't, they won't sponsor us, so mm-hmm. <laughs> blur this can. So those guys are just across Main Street here, so that'll be a short little drive. So we'll probably go check on them. I don't know what else. What else are we doing today? How many times do you think you've just said so? Did I? Look, uh, honest question. Two. Did I just say it? <laughs> Damn it. All right. All right. So today. <laughs> you just did it again. All right. How many times did I say it? Have I said it already three or four times? Oh, easy. What the fuck? So. Shh. <laughs> I yeah. just said it again. Yeah, I know. Tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. We're really working on this today. I gotta really think about what I'm saying. You wanted to. <laughs> you wanted to, didn't you? <laughs> it's really hard to do. Just bring it back. Bring it back. Yeah, you, you seem more comfortable with it. I'm way more comfortable when I can throw in my soles. Yeah. It's <laughs> a lot of editing, though. It's fine. I'm not going to clip them out like I did this last time. That took forever. Just deleting them is easy. Yeah. I must say a lot because I'm trying really hard. <laughs> Just you leave it alone. You have to say it sometimes. <laughs> You're trying to give you yourself to. some leeway? <laughs> you have to. People have to say it sometimes. So. 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 So, 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 so. <laughs> How many times do you think you just said it in that hole? I don't know, Derek. I just say it, I guess. I don't know. All right, no more, no more talking about it. Yeah, no more talking about it. I'm just gonna do as I please. Since I pay the bills, it's my camera, it's my YouTube. I'm the boss, I'm in charge, so if I want to say so all day, I'll say so all day. <laughs> you know, that kind of reminds me of uh, Family Guy, you know, when they do their little bits and they just drag it on for, you know. Five minutes? Yeah. That's what that reminds me of. Yeah. It got funny, and then it got annoying, and then it got funny again. I didn't realize it was that bad. Until <laughs> till now. Now I see that it's bad. So. <laughs> Man, we're going to have to send you to rehab or so. something. <laughs> what yeah. are you taking in today for, sir? I was trying really hard not to this morning. I don't know. <laughs> What's going to be my next filler word? What do you think? Should we all take a big ice fishing trip and videotape it this winter if there's no snow? Yeah, I'd be down for that. Yeah? I'm bring my ice fishing shack. What is it? A teepee? No, it's like a flip up ice shanty. Can you eat it? Huh? Can you eat it? Yeah. Oh, nice. Farmer's merch shop estate. Our merch. That's hard to say. <laughs> <laughs> 